Welcome to this week's edition of the Falcon Report. This week is November 4th through November 18th. Let's check in with PlayRigs for the game of the week. The game of the week is soccer passing. As a reminder, we'll show you how it's done. You're gonna pass the ball, stop it, and pass back. If you mastered that distance, take a step back. Try it again. Pass, stop, pass, stop, way to go. Keep going. Now back to our reporter for this week's story highlights. Here are our high flyers for safety. In kindergarten, Abigail, Annie, Journey. In first grade, Valentina. In second grade, Cohen, Shiloh. In third grade, Allison, Amy, and Bren. Fourth grade, McKenna, Jean, Aaron in fifth grade, Adriana and Jack. Way to go, High Flyers. Hi, I'm with Ben from second grade. Ben, I heard that you went on a field trip. Yes, we went to the bee museum and learned about habitats. Where is the bee museum? It's in Pueblo. What did you do there? We saw different animals and learned about their homes. Was it fun? Yes. Thanks, Ben. You're welcome. Now I'm with Lila from kindergarten. Lila, can you share with us something that you did in class? I made a turkey from Halloween wrappers. Cool. Thank you for sharing with us, Lila. You're welcome. We currently have 39,725 care cards. Our goal is 45,000 Keep up the good work, Falcons. Hi, I'm back with Miss Broderick. She was my teacher in fourth grade. I did have you in fourth grade, and it's so good to see you. And there's Grace behind the camera. <laughs> where are you from, Miss Broderick? Okay, where am I from? I am from Idaho originally. However, I have lived in Utah longer than I did in Idaho by this time in my life. Interesting. Yes. How long have you been teaching? Okay, Arwen, let's see if we can figure this out. Should we just suffice it to say that I taught your mom and your mom was so wonderful. So would you say I've been teaching a little bit or a long time? A long time? Yeah! <laughs> That's right. Um, do you have any pets? Oh my goodness, my goodness, my goodness. Okay, pets. Yes, I do, right now. We have three chickens. And one of them is Oreo. Why do you think it's named Oreo? What color is it? Black and white. Good job! Now, the next one is named Pinecone. And guess who named it? Um... Who could have named it? Say my class. Um, your class. Yes! Three years ago, my class got to name one of the chickens, and its name is Pinecone. And then the other one is Husky Jim, that my hunk of a man named. Husky Jim. Um, what is your favorite movie or TV show? Okay, so this one is really going to age me. Have you ever heard of Perry Mason? No. Have you ever heard of Sherlock Holmes? 
It sounds familiar. Yeah. Have you ever heard of Agatha Christie? No. So, all of them have a certain genre. You remember what genre means, right? What does that mean in reading? Um, it means um, what the story is um, based on. Yeah, or, or a, a type of reading, yeah. right? The type of reading. I love mysteries. Oh, I love mysteries. Any mysteries. So Perry Mason is one of my favorite shows because it's a mystery. I should check out a mystery book next time I go to the library. Thank you, Miss Broderick. We love having you at Sprucewood. I love being here, Arwen, and I love seeing you and Grace. Woohoo! Bye, everyone. Here's what's happening at Sprucewood this week. There is an art assembly today. Kindergarten first and second will go at one, and third, fourth, and fifth will go at 1.40. Tuesday morning, third, fourth, and fifth graders get to see Alta's musical, The Adams Family. Have a great week, Falcons. Yeah.